Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Simon. And I am a rail enthusiast, loves going up and down the country, riding on the trains, filming and taking photos of them as well. These videos of my railway journeys can differ sometimes as they can go to plan or will go bad. Welcome to Simon Trains Railway Journeys. Everyone, and welcome to Rouge Trent Valley Station. Now, my train is on platform two, which I will be going over there in a minute, but I'm just doing the intro on platform three because it's a bit windy this morning. So, so you can hear me basically. Today, we are going to Scotland, which is up north. And when we got to Scotland after changing trains and crew, I'm catching the 0643 to crew, and then I'm catching the 0829 to Glasgow Central. But when we get to Scotland, We'll be going to four stations today. Uddiston, West Calder, which when I'm at West Calder, I'll explain why I'm there. Then we'll go to Slayford, and then we're going to end it off at Ethan Keithin. So I'm going to go over to platform two now to catch the 0649 to crew by Stoke on Trent. made it to Crew Station. Now, I was hoping to see if I get the Bally flasks through here because there was a path from Crew to the Bally in North Wales. But as soon as my train got right here at 740, it left at 739, which is a shame really. But um, we only get Crew to change trains to get to Glasgow Central, which will be 809 off here. So I'm just going to get some breakfast and then wait for my train. Our phone news suite is delayed by approximately 30 minutes. This is due to a fault on this train. Virgin trains apologise for this late journey and the inconvenience this may cause you. Six, four, nine, eight, four, nine, four,
I'm now at Oddington Station. I'm here eating some chips. Uh, George is also here. You met him uh, in a few videos last year while we were in Scotland, but he's um, eating chips at the moment, having some lunch. But um, anyway, so we're at Oddington. Now, last year, I couldn't fit Oddington into any plans. So this is why I'm doing Oddington first, because I thought it wasn't fair because I couldn't, like I said, couldn't fit it into any plans last year. But so I'm doing it first, and then it's simple to get to West Calder from here. Because I'm having out of distance filming the trains arriving, departing, and passing through, of course. And then get a 156 to the next station, do some filming there. A Be a 158. Maybe. It'd be a 156 or 158. So then. I'll explain more when we get to West Calder while I'm there. But anyway, we're going to stay here for a bit and then do some more filming. We are at West Calder Station but we're not getting off the train now because we apparently the train. Yeah we found out that they cancelled um, the train so instead of getting five trades an hour here you're only gonna get three trades an hour which is not really worth it. So what we're gonna do instead is is carry on with this train and we're gonna go to King's Own. King's Now. Oh, is it King's Now? Yeah. King's Now station and film there instead. And then go on to Slateford after that. What do you talk on this is? Yeah, it's a real show because I was looking forward to filming on the shots line, but since the cattle trade, then you just have to be change the plan quickly. So we're just leaving um, West Calder now, and we're going to Kings now.
I'm now at Kingsdale Station. Now this is the replacement of West Calder because probably West Calder was, they cancelled the train and instead of getting five trains an hour, you would only get four trains an hour, which I thought it wasn't really worth it. So that's why I came here instead to get more traffic. But what turns out to be a nice surprise is we did get a DRS direct rail services class 57 diesel locomotive holding the coach through here. Well, actually stopped because the barriers needed to come down and they left. But the reason why I was going to do West Calder Station was to catch a DMUs on the shot slide before they turned into EMUs. But um, after this station, we go to Slateford, which will be back on track when we get our train out of here. Because the same train we're going to get out of here will be the same train we got out of West Calder.
Daniels, Curry Hill, Kirk Newton, Livingston South, West Calder, Addyville, Bolt House, Short, Hartfield, Cleland, Carthen, Hollytown, Gales Hill, Livingston, and
now at Ifer Keefin station, which is the last station I'm doing today. As you can see, it is starting to get dark, so there'll be no more filming of hourly stations after this one. We're here till 1853. Then I'm going to get the uh, local hall, which you got leaving Edmund Waverley, to Haymarket. Now, this one does stop at the loop at Dalmeny after the station to allow other trains to pass through, which is fine. But it um, gives me a chance to warm up a little bit. It has been a bit cold today, but it's nothing really. Uh, there's a train arriving in a second. What we've done is we actually took the other local hall train to Carden Den 2L69 from Edinburgh Waverley to here. Now, you can roughly have an hour here, and then after the hour, the other one comes in 2K14, which is the one from Grand Office to Thornton. So that's how I'm doing you for Keefin between two local hall trains. We did get HST flying through here as well, which was in service. I don't know where it came from, but it was going to Ed Edinburgh Waverley. So we're going to be here for about half an hour, and then, well, a little less actually, half an hour, and then we're going to catch our train that way.
I'm gonna take this train. Now arrived at Edinburgh Park. Now I'm going to go over there because the KFC is over there. I'm going to get some tea. Once I get something to eat, I'm going to the hotel, which is literally just behind me here, the Premier Inn. And then I'm going to do the summary when I get in the hotel. I'm now in the hotel at Edinburgh Park. Uh, they pull us at the back of the hotel, so the station is actually that side of the hotel, the wrong side, I might in. And today went pretty well apart from one thing, and that was I didn't do West Calder. Now fortunately they cancelled one train, and we only had four trains in an hour at West Calder. So I thought, nah, not worth it. So I was a bit disappointed that I didn't film any diesel multiple units on the shots line, but not to worry because on Thursday, I will be filming at Shots Station hopefully, so you should get some diesel multiple units on the Shots line at Shots. Say that three times fast. Um, we went to Odinston, no problems there, everything went well. Like I said, West Calder, which I mentioned earlier. Um, so we did Kingsdown instead, and I think there was another crossing problem at Kingsdown because everything was just pulling up to signals, stopping, slowly going through the double crossing. But it was a bit fun. We did get a direct rail service, class 57 out of it as well, with a Mark II carriage, which was brilliant. Did Slateford, no problems. Got a test tray from Craig and Tilly, which I did not know about till it came around the corner on the Edinburgh Suburban Line. And then we got a couple of freights there. And then Infi Keefin was alright. So everything went alright as planned today, apart from West Calder which is brilliant. Now tomorrow's plan, because um, it is going to be a bit different, we will be filming at some stations. We're going to start off at Nognidri, then we're going to do Nanifgo, Polmont, um, going to change at Falkirk Grayson to get to Dunblane, then we're going to do Camlon, then we're going to do Greenfalls, I think that's how I say it, then Cumberland, then Falkirk Grayson. The only problem is with tomorrow is at 12 o'clock, 
nice sound effect, is that uh, there's going to be high winds of 50 miles per hour. And they're going to last till Wednesday lunchtime. So we picked a perfect day to be in Scotland. So that's tomorrow. So I'm going to leave it now so you can subscribe at uh, Simon Trades Rail Jews on Facebook, Simon Trades at Instagram, Simon Trades at Twitter. Thank you for watching, and I will see you tomorrow for day two out of four. Well, actually, be day two out of eight. Is it my copy of Jugs?